Descartes said that there was something called thinking substance. This substance had no extension and no location. You could not find it in any local place. It was strictly non-local, Descartes wrote. I thence concluded that I was a substance whose whole essence or nature consists only in thinking, and which, that it may exist, has need of no place, nor is dependent on any material thing. So that I, that is to say, the mind by which I am what I am, is wholly distinct from the body, and is even more easily known than the latter. Your body is an extended material, local thing. Your mind is an unextended, immaterial, non-local thing. It's associated with your body, but is not in your body. Leibniz called a single thinking substance a monad. This is your mind, your soul. It doesn't die with your body, because it was never in your body. You therefore have a guaranteed afterlife. Descartes believed in a substance, dualism, of mind and matter. But no one could work out how mind and matter could interact, given that they had opposite definitions. Mind after all, is unextended and matter extended. The solution is that mind is the real substance, true reality, primary reality, and it projects a secondary reality of space-time with which it interacts via forward and inverse Fourier transforms. So there is no substance dualism. What there is is a dualistic mathematical monism a mathematical core reality of frequency equals mind. Non-extension projects a secondary mathematical domain of space-time equals matter extension. This domain began as none other than the Big Bang. Because two domains now exist, it looks like a dualism, when in fact it is a dualistic monism. There is only one mathematical reality, but it can appear in two different ways, as mind and matter. Descartes, a brilliant mathematician, intuited all of this, but the mathematics necessary to properly explain all of this did not exist in his day, it does now. This is a mathematical reality, not a scientific reality. Descartes and Leibniz got incredibly close to fully explaining everything, but they lacked Euler's formula and Fourier mathematics. Are you changed forever by this astonishing information?